Hey, yo, what is up, everybody? My name is Bob, and you guys are watching Bob Bot 101. Let's go. So in today's video, we are playing a game by the developer who made Inside, Get Spooked, and many other games I've also played. Yep, it is... He told me the pronunciation of his name. Give me a second. Give me a second. Yeah, it's a he, by the way. It's a guy, not a girl. I made a mistake last video. It's not a girl, it's a guy. And the pronunciation, the correct pronunciation of his name is... What is the pr correct pronunciation of your name? Andres. Yes, I remember now. He gave me a voice note, and uh, the pronunciation of his name is Andres. Yeah, yeah. His name is Andres Bennett. He is a very amazing game developer. I He also made Floors 1, and there's also a third part to Floors 3. I am willing to play it, but I think it's all the same concept. I'm not sure. We're going to find out in this game also if you guys are noticing i'm wearing a scarf and a hat because it's winter time here it's really cold i even have a heater on it's the best time of year because in this time of the year you don't have to constantly change your clothes why i know you guys notice my clothes in every video i am wearing the same shirt from the last video because you don't sweat like a donkey in the winter so it doesn't smell bad. Anyway, I know I'm acting all weird and all that. It's been quite a long time. Let's jump right into the gameplay of Floors 2. Let's go! Yep, there it is. Andres. I still hope I'm pronouncing it correctly, even after him telling me. Okay, Floors 2. Start. Quit. This game contains flashing images. So if you guys have epileptic seizures, I recommend that you don't do it. Okay. Instructions. No instructions whatsoever. WASD, arrow keys to move, mouse to look around, left shift is to sprint. 100 floors and less is bad. 100 to 500 floors is normal. 100 to 1000 floors is good. He forgot the equal sign. There's no equal sign. You missed an equal sign, Andres. Andres. You missed the equal sign there. And 1000 more floors and more is excellent. Well, obviously, I'm not getting to 1000 floors. Let's see what this game holds. Let's start off. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's actually really good. Oh, damn. <laughs> Andres. Andres. Damn. <laughs> that cinematic panning was amazing. Okay, so, uh, I think I'll go up. Not sure how this game works, so. Uh, no floor count so far. I don't know why. Okay, there's floor one. How many floor? How many staircases do I have to go up before going to the next floor? In this game, he has really good graphics in his game. I do have to give him that. His graphics are amazing. Oh, okay. I think I get the concept of the game. It's to see how far you can go. Oh my lord! Really? This shouldn't be that hard then. You're just walking upstairs. What's the worst that can happen? Okay, so I think two flights of stairs or three flights of stairs equal one floor. Nope, four flights of stairs equal one floor? This camera sensitivity is bothering me. Oh no, this is two less. Okay, wait. Uh, yeah, this seems fine. So I'm just going upstairs. Is that all I have to do in this game? I'm already at floor six. Oh, oh lord, oh god. Oh, oh lord, oh god. Oh, okay, wait. Okay, calm down. Oh god. What in the world was that? I only reached the seven floors in 11.2 seconds. Hang on, hang on. What in the world was that? Time out. Am I in the game? Am I supposed to see the cinematic panning once again? Hey yo! I think my game broke. I think it didn't pick up my mouse. Wait, my mouse is off. No, it's not. 
Time out. Two thousand years later. Am I in the game? Uh, something happened to my game. Hang on. Six and a half hours later. There you go. Take two. Okay, so I do have to see the cinematic padding every time around this light. No, this is gonna be a very short gameplay. What was that thing that attacked me? Let's try going downstairs this time. Okay, let's go. Okay, so this is me walking. And this is me. I felt like when that thing hit me, uh, I couldn't move. I started going slow. I'm gonna just sprint the entire time, hugging the wall. Under is like, how did you make so many floors? If you're saying 1,000, you probably used the loop. You probably used the loop, didn't you? You looped your code, causing it the new floors to be made automatically. How much? Yeah, that's probably true. You looped the fl you looped the floors, and then you randomized the ghost entry, didn't you? That's basically what it is. You made simple code into a complex game. That is amazing. I just wish there was no motion blur. That is 100% amazing, my friend. And if it, that is what you did, do tell me, because I'm guessing. Okay, I'm already at floor 9, and I'm keeping a Call of Duty vision on, on the next staircase, making sure that I don't get trailed. So Demon Boy ain't here yet. I'm at floor 11. If I even get to 100, I'm happy. That's what the goal is in this game, getting to floor 100. At least we should be normal. Not we, The first round was bad. Like, for real, that was bad. Hey, downstairs actually is giving me a lot of freebies. Like, I'm already at floor 20, I would say. No, floor 15. Yep, here is 15. Still no sign of Ghost Boy. Maybe he's upstairs. <laughs> Maybe we left him upstairs. No, but for real, the randomizer on this ghost has to... Is it according to the timing? Well, I understand the first part of it being a loop. The go oh. Okay, here's Ghost Boy. Foul God, here you go. Okay, just hug the wall and he cannot get you. Just hug the wall and he cannot get you. Just hug the wall and he cannot get you. Okay. Okay, so the two in the bracket, the, the number that's coming in the bracket is telling me the floors that I cross after Ghost Boy comes alive. Let's say I'm on floor 21, but after the first attack, I'm on floor 4. Okay. Okay. I think that's the best part. You don't know when Ghost Boy's gonna come after you. Alright okay, guys, we're getting to floor 100. We're getting to floor 100. Oh god, oh lord. Don't hit me. Oh. Oh god, that's a very big hole in the gameplay. If you just hug the wall and run by... Oh! Again? Oh, he was kind of fast this time. That was a back-to-back -back one. Nah, but I think that's a... Out of the entire gameplay, I think that's a flaw. I would say that's a flaw. Oh god, how many times... He yeah, I mean, see? He's running in a straight line. And you could just hug the wall and run past him. Demon would pop- Oh! <laughs> Your jump scares are loud as hell. They're loud. We get into floor 100, homie. We get in a good position. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> I need a thumbnail. Ayo. Nope! Yeah, I need a good thumbnail. Hang on. Okay, wait. I'm gonna look at him this time. Thumbnail. Got. Freeze frame that and get the thumbnail. Haha. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah. It's more simple now that I understand that I just have to hug the wall. Oh my lord, but he is popping off a lot. Oh. Oh, I almost ran right into him. 
<laughs> I almost gave up my life. I'm sorry, are we on? My fingers are hurting now. I don't want to take it. Oh! It's a good thing I'm wearing a hat today. Because, like, the sound is getting masked by the covers on my ears. So it, it's loud that it's piercing through it, but it's getting reduced. And now it's to the point where I'm not getting scared. We're getting to 100, and then we're gonna get a thumbnail for both demons. Probably by that time there'll be three of the homeboys, the three musketeers, the de three demoneers, whatever you all want to call them. Let's see. But after 100, that's the goal at least. We could get to 100, it's not that hard now knowing that I know what to do. I'd oh! I got hit? Oh, looks like they are changing the path now. Oh my god. Wait, were there three this time? Oh my god, how did I not notice that? Hey, I got a hit. No, there's still two. But maybe I was too close to the last game. Don't worry, we're making it to 100. A hundo. We're making it to one hundo. At least one hundo. Now we're gonna get railed on purpose. Hug the wall. Yeah, then we're gonna get railed on purpose at a hundo. So nothing to worry about at that time. This is a real case scenario too. If you are in a uh, place where you have to run away, you just hug the wall and you should be fine. Hug the wall, hug the wall. Oh no! I almost ran into those. Okay. They're just popping off a lot now. Like a <laughs> okay, hug the wall, hug the wall, hug the wall. Don't pay attention to them. I'm not gonna lose at 82. I'm not losing. We get into a hundo no matter what. And it's funny, I have constantly been pressing W, D, and shift. For 84 floors now, and my fingers are hurting badly. We get into a hundo no matter what. We get into one hundo. We're almost there, we're almost there, we're not giving up. Six more floors, six more floors, six more floors. We are getting at normal. At least. I'm not playing for 1,000 floors. Hell no, that's a long game. That's like a 20 minute game. Okay, we're almost there, 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 we're almost there. We're almost there. Oh, that. oh, man, six. Ah, damn. That is upsetting. Just four more floors and I could have made it. I'm not playing that again. 96 is a record. 96 is a record. That's not bad. That's normal. That's normal. On days you have to change the thing. You should be more than 50 is normal. Damn. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay of Floors 2. If you can beat my score. My score of 96 floors. 71. 70, 71? 81. There's a difference of 17. 79. Yeah, math, quick math. 79 after the demon popped up in 660 something seconds. Beat me. I, it's a challenge. I'm gonna leave the link of this game in the description down below. Go down there, check it out for yourself, try and beat my score. Beat it. Okay? Anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video of Floors 2, don't forget to leave a comment of what I should play next. Leave a like. And if you are new to the Bot Bot family, hit the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to know when I upload a new video. That's enough from me. I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.